All you need to enjoy this next game is a bingo card, bingo markers, and a sense of adventure. And no whining allowed. Just kidding. Lodi Roll says it's a fun and interactive way for all ages to get out of the house and into the rich soils of the Lodi wine region with a sustainability bingo scavenger hunt. Stephanie Bolton from Lodi Rules is here now to tell us how we all can get in on the action. It's a good old game of bingo with a little bit of a twist, right? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> and for people who are not familiar with Lodi, what can you tell us about it? So Lodi is a city just south of Sacramento, just east of the Bay Area. It's a great stopover place if you're heading over to Tahoe or Yosemite. And we have just vineyards for miles and miles and miles. We've been growing wine grapes here since the 1800s. We have generational farming families. It's an awesome place to do a fun, family-friendly wine tour when you have a bingo card to play along. <laughs> and you can... Um, <laughs> You can really come here to learn more about the farming side of the wine industry because we are um, over 100,000 acres of vineyards is what we have here and over 120 different grape varieties. That's awesome. And I'm going to get right to it because I have my own bingo cards here. You guys sent me some and I'm like, oh my gosh, I need to play. But tell us, what is this bingo scavenger hunt all about? These cards are so pretty, by the way, very nicely done. Ah, thank you so much. So we worked with Suzanne Ledbetter. She writes for San Joaquin Magazine, and we wanted to do something that was pandemic friendly and family friendly so that we could teach all ages about sustainability. A lot of people ask us, you know, what does sustainability mean? You all have this great Lodi Rule certification program, but what is sustainability? So we had worked with an artist to create this gorgeous sustainable vineyard map that you just saw there. And we used the icons from the map to create the travel bingo game so that you can drive around wine country and you can see sustainability in action as you play bingo. Very nice. And this is all tied into an annual celebration for the California wine industry, correct? Absolutely. So California for 10 years now, thanks to the Wine Institute's initiative, has been celebrating California Down to Earth Month. And it's just really a way to celebrate the um, great things that our whole industry is doing to prepare the prepare for future generations, you know, preserving the land, taking care of our communities. And so we, we didn't want to just celebrate one day per year, right, on Earth Day. We wanted to celebrate for the whole month of April. Very nice. And I mean, obviously, I think this is a great way for locals and visitors to interact with your wine region, learn about it. Let's tell me about some of the different squares on these boards. Okay, I'd love to. So I think my favorite square is the dog. And you, all, all of our farmers here, they're driving around in their trucks. They are um, alone for a lot of the day, checking on the irrigation system, checking on the soil, checking on the vines. Um, looking out for pests and diseases, and they have their trusty companion, the dog. And you might think, well, how does that how is that related to sustainability? But if you think about it, it's a it's a big mental health component for a farmer to have a trusty, faithful companion, a dog. And we've even had stories like my boss's father, where a dog has saved has saved the farmer's life in the vineyard. So, oh my goodness! Well, I, I'm on example. my way to bingo because I have dog on both of my cards. Okay, so. I <laughs> I, I can awesome. put my sticker, awesome. my sustainability sticker down, and I'm I'm one step closer to bingo. Also, talk a little bit about what it means. You mentioned sustainable farming. What what does that mean to be certified in California? Yeah. So in simple terms, it means farming in a way that is environmentally and socially responsible while also being economically viable, and then getting an audit to prove that you are doing those practices that promote sustainable farming. Um, our Lodi Rules motto is, may we farm in a way that meets the needs of today without compromising the ability of future generations to create their own livelihood. Yeah, and this is fun too, because you can do it with the whole family. Obviously the kids aren't going to be uh, sampling the wine, but you know they can learn about the different farming practices. So how else can we support you with sustainable wine growing? Oh, thank you so much for asking. We would love more support. So. Being aware of what the term sustainable means is a great start. So please check out our website at LodiRules.org to learn more about what sustainability means. We have a really cute video on there where our children of farmers and vintners explain sustainability in their own words. And what's awesome is that they get it. They really understand it. And also it'd be great if you could, when you're going out to buy your next bottle of wine, if you could ask the person selling wine at the wine shop, you know, hey, do you have any certified sustainable wines here that we can try? Um, it's it's really important that we ask for these wines um, with the certified green seals and logos so that we can promote and help the farmers do their job on the farms, right? Farming sustainably. 
All right. Well, thank you so much. I've got my cards here. I'm going to have to head over to Lodi so I can really get the bingo. But I want to thank you for joining us this morning. If you want in on bingo, check out LodiRules.org.